What the heck? This is a giant, you guys. Look at him down there. Oh, 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 oh. Guys, welcome back. Today we are fishing at Abraham Lake. This is my friend Barry. What's up? And uh, we did about, what, 4K hike in? That was a long walk. And we just got set up. Um, freaking beautiful out here, you guys. The scenery is absolutely amazing. I've tried to do this trip for uh, a couple of years now. So we're gonna get at this here, try and catch you guys some lake trout and bull trout are our target species. And look at the ice color. Beautiful blue. So today we're set up in 29 feet of water. I fished this spot in the summer in my open water fishing video and it was 47 feet. So we got about 20 feet shallower. If I would have drilled my first hole that my, if I would have drilled out my first pin that was 27 feet, um, we would have been in seven feet of water. So let's pray there's some fish here. So I am gonna try jigging a silver acme cast master. Try and uh, bring in some fish. Lake Trout always like aggressive jigging. So it's minus 11 out there. I have the uh, medium heavy deadbolt. I got the short butt end on right now because we're in a really small shack. We downsized everything for the hike into here. Um, so I brought the 250 Eskimo shack. This lake is a man-made reservoir. And in the summer in August, it fills right up and uh, slowly the water level drops through the year. And end of March, early April is when the water is at its lowest. So right now, the lake is at its lowest. Okay, um, we haven't marked anything for an hour and a half. I uh, drilled some holes shallow, along a shallow drop and I marked two fish right away. And uh, we're gonna Probably have to move the shack here in about five minutes, so. Okay, I'm gonna move the shack. Even if these are uh, mountain white fish or something, it's still 24 feet right here, so it's only four feet shallower, so it's a big flat all the way out there. And all the fish I've been marking right along shore here, so we'll get the shack and peg her down over here. Bring an ice drill. You're in 21, good. All right, hopefully, he's... oh, here we go. Fish yeah. already coming in. Yeah, I see that. Small. Oh, he hit me. He hit me. <laughs> he's on Still you Still on me. Oh, he's going for you. Look at that, he's right on you. He's gonna hit you. Oh, oh, he hit, hit they're you? Rockies, yeah. Think they're Rockies? Yeah, 100% there. Yeah. What do you got on? That little micro dinner bell. He hit. The tiny. Yeah, here's another fish. Oh, yeah, he hit me again. Yeah, these are. Hey, I freaking. All right, guys, I'm on. Nice. <laughs> I don't know what this is. It's small, though. But, oh, it's a nice rocky action. Nice. Oh yeah, look at that. You're... Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys, so we kind of switched directions here. We were having some issues finding Lakers. Finding any fish. So Sean went out, sacrificed himself in the wind. Yeah. Found some fish and we downsized. I'm using a micro frostbite dinner bell. There we go, little Rockies. Or little premiers as Ricky would call them. Oh, big fish. Look oh, at that. Yeah, yeah. That's a Laker. Yeah. Big fish coming in. Big fish. This, why you, this is why you move if you don't know. Yeah. Like Sean move. said, 
if you don't know and you're not finding the fish put the work in yeah it'll be you'll find some bigger fish they'll be up in the shallows that was what maybe Instant. 30 seconds 45 seconds of me fishing well i better put it i might have to put a dinner bell on now too i got hit twice but these little tubes they're hard they're like the mouth of the rockies can't get in them yeah look at these is that the size you got That's exactly this is what I got. Oh, here's two fish. Yeah. Oh no. There's it. There he is. There he is. Sean got him. I'm gonna try and get one, one rocky, <laughs> one rocky mountain white fish, and then I'm gonna stick to going for some lake trout now. I'll show you guys this rocky. They're uh, like a white fish. If, oh, they're like a white fish, but their mouths are a little bit different. That's uh, that would be amazing for some bait. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like a, a nice, perfect Cisco size. And uh, so I was told by a friend, Clayton, to use a micro dinner bell. So that's what they catch those uh, mountain white fish on here. Um, I'm gonna switch it up for some lake trout and go back to my cast master it's a bit bigger so now they've caught one mountain whitefish you don't smell funny i don't smell funny like a skunk and uh, i'm gonna go for my target species a lake trout i'm gonna hit you that's either a big there you go A little bit better. Yeah. Just another rocky. It's yeah. a little bit bigger, eh? A little bit. Oh. <laughs> right in the hole. Awesome. There we go. Perfect release. They're going to hit you. There's like seven of them. Oh. oh, you had them. Yeah, I had them. Hit you? Yeah. My hook's way too big for a hit, though, eh? Hit me again. Oh! Just dialed on that dinner bell. This one feels a little bigger. Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah. Got a laker? I don't know. Nope, just a bigger rocky. Yeah. Nice. There we go. Bit better. You got that hair jig? Yeah, I do. A little one too. Where it's in your tackle box? Yeah, if you grab those two little boxes there. Taxes, right? Yeah. This is what happened with Wesley and I. Twelve o'clock game. Sean, look at, look at, look at, Sean, 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 Sean. Oh. On, on. What the heck? Oh, huge, bo huge, huge lake trout. Get yours in. Yep, yeah, mine's in. I think I told you that. Okay, you guys. I don't know if you've seen what I was doing there, but I was putting my rod in the roof of the shack because I was bored. Barry looks over at the sonar and there's a fish eating my hook. Oh my. This is a giant lake trout, you guys. We came, woke up at 3.30, wanted to make this trip. We were out too deep, we thought. We came shallower, please let me get this fish. Oh my goodness. This is a giant. We moved shallower. Oh, here it is. What a beautiful fish. Oh, beautiful yellow fins. You guys, come on. 
Oh my goodness. So I'm gonna charge out. No, I'm good. I just gotta get his head started. What a giant. Come on. He's all wrapped up right now. Oh man. Look at him down there. Here he comes. Yeah. I'm gonna dig deep. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh my goodness, I'm wet. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, I got soaked for that fish. Look at that tank. Look at that tank, you guys. Guys, that's a 32 inch fish all day long. Maybe 30, I'd say 30. We don't have a measuring tape. What do we got? We'll mark it on my rod. Okay, we're gonna mark it on 50 inch running gun. The very tip. To almost this, about an inch an off An inch the off the last eyelet. We're letting this giant go. A giant Abraham Lake lake trout. Oh man, what a gorgeous fish. <laughs> yes! Well guys, um no more fish after that lake trout. Um, it died down quite a bit. We had uh, a couple more fish come in, but uh, thanks for watching us and uh, sticking it out here at Abraham Lake and catching that giant lake trout was a bonus. So thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.